Praise the Lord. battles he says to you just stand still the Lord will fight your battles uh, amen. amen you stand still in the word of God you keep pursuing the Lord Jesus stand firm in the word of God and he will fight your battles yeah. amen. 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 Sunday night, and uh, God's hand was just upon him because um, I, was, I was going somewhere else with my kids, going to take them somewhere to tucker them out, and the Lord just told me, we're going to go to Burns. So I pulled up to Burns, and, and his truck pulls in, and, and Mark got out, and I just said, hey, Mark, this teaching's pretty good, eh? <laughs> I don't know your name, but I said, hey, this, this Burns is pretty good, but you can share well, What happened there? Are you okay with sharing? I replied, I said, it's my favorite, <laughs> and uh, she... I just, uh, the Spirit of the Lord came on me, so I started testifying about yeah. my testimony. I always go with testimony, so I yes. started about yeah. testimony. And he started getting goosebumps all over his arms. And then I just started walking up to him, and I was just drawn to him. And yeah, that was, that was, that was it. And, uh, it started like that. And uh, I kind of shared, he, he was kind of in a rush. He had the babies and stuff like that. So I kind of shared my story with him a little bit. And me and him, we had very similar pasts. And it was just... It was right, you know, right time, right place, right time. Yeah, yeah I got, a, I, I had a word of knowledge about uh, death. Actually, mm. tried to take him out. That's what it was, and, and it hit, hit his heart because uh, a few years back, you, you something. Go ahead. Well, yeah, when I was 19 years old, um, this is this is something I'm kind of. Uh, after a 23 year battle with drug addiction, I am happy to say for the first time in 23 years, I am 100% drug free of all. Uh, so, um, yeah, uh, unfortunately, yes, when I was 19 years old, um, my drug addiction had got so bad that I did try to take my own life. Um, you know, by the, the the Lord didn't let that happen. Yes. Yeah. Um, the past couple of years, I've been going back to my old ways and stuff like that. And um, I I hit a new I hit a new low, and I worked too hard, was <laughs> doing too good to go back to my old way. So enough was enough, and yeah. enough is enough. And yeah. 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 Hallelujah, Lord. He said he'd like to get baptized, and just on Sunday night, uh, Terry mentioned that there's a baptism service. So just the timing, the Lord lined it up. So we'll get on the tank here, Mark. Yes. Just so if you don't know who he is, this great, this is Brayden, and uh, Brayden. it's Brayden Hall, and he's, he's originally from Yorkton, but they live in Fort Worth, Texas. So he's just they, him and his wife Elizabeth and their children are just back for a funeral for his grandpa, grandpa yeah. lost him, and, yeah. and, and he was in New Albany. So he just popped in and he just ran. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. 
Wow. Oh. Mark upon the profession of your faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. We now baptize you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, which is the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yes, he will. Yes, amen. You've been bought with a high price, so you're going to glorify God with your body. Amen. You stay forward, you're going to say, I <laughs> She's getting the full also. <laughs> Everything today. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Woo. Woo. <laughs> Gord, if you want to just close in prayer, prayer, prayer upon your profession of your faith in Jesus Christ as your Lord, Savior, and Master, and I'll baptize you in your prayer. Thank you. 